Dealing with gender dysphoria at school can sometimes feel as elusive as chasing rainbows. Or trying to find a unicorn at the mall. Here are some practical tips to help you navigate through those rough days where you're feeling like trash, oh trash. Find allies. Look for teachers or counsellors or even friends who are willing to lend a helping hand. Or maybe a magic wand if they've got one. Seek out peers and teachers who are knowledgeable about LGBTQ plus matters. Create a safe space where you are able to share your feelings and concerns. Use gender affirming language. Even if you're not out yet, or your school isn't the most accepting environment, that's okay. You can still use language that affirms your gender without disclosing it. For instance, you could ask your friends and trusted teachers to use your preferred name and pronouns, even if it isn't official school policy. This small step can make a huge difference about how you feel at school. Always prioritize self-care. Dealing with gender dysphoria can be emotionally draining, like trying to win a water fight with a leaky water pistol. So make sure to take care of yourself outside of school. Find hobbies and activities that bring you joy and relaxation. Seek online support. The internet can be a powerful tool for connecting with others who understand what you are going through. There are countless online communities and forums and social media groups like my Discord server, which is linked in the description below, where you can find a community that understands, supports, and believes in your full potential. Educate others. Sometimes the misconceptions around gender identity stem from ignorance. If you feel safe doing so, talk to your classmates or some of your friends and share your transgender experience and the importance of respect. Sharing your story can help break down stereotypes and foster a more accepting environment. Dealing with gender dysphoria at school can be tougher than doing your maths homework while riding a unicycle. No, no, I'm not doing that. But you are not alone in this circus of life. You are valid, important, and deserving of love and respect. Remember, you can always seek help and lean on your allies. And when you are facing difficulties, always prioritise self-care. You've got this.